This is the before countertop. And this is the lady who's responsible for making it into the after countertop. Look how awesome that turned out. And it's not even done yet. But we're doing this to save some, some cashola. I think the wife's doing a wonderful job. I will take credit for the idea because I found this kit. But uh, she does it because she thinks I suck at painting. Um, which is probably true. She paints everything. She painted everything. She used to paint like stuff when I was at work and I'd come home and be surprised by it. Now she paints cabinets and doors and all this stuff and it looks a lot better. Uh, this is the house we just bought last year. But let me know what you guys think about this countertop. It's a kit. It's like 200 bucks. And uh, the countertops I ordered my wife that never showed up um, cost, how much do they cost? 1100 1200 something like that. A couple, almost $1,200. And this kit was only $200, and you just reuse your 1977 countertops, and you give them a nice new little adjustment. And how, how hard is it, babe? Is it pretty easy? Yeah, and, and so, that's it. That's like halfway done. Yeah, and then it gets uh, sanded in a clear coat, and then it looks like, I guess it looks like black onyx is what they call it. But... That's super cool. And those are paint chips that we put over top of a paint level, blah, 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 paint layer. And then you put a epoxy resin over top of that to make it look like a rock. Like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, we'll see you on the next one.